7. Paracutin, Michoacan, Mexico. The eruption of the Paracutin scoria cone from 1943 to 1952 marks the first time scientists were able to observe the complete life cycle of a volcano, from birth to extinction. Three weeks before the eruption, the people near Paracutin village heard the rumbling noises that resembled thunder, yet they were confused because the skies were clear of clouds. The noises were associated with earthquakes at depth near Paracutin. On February 20, 1943, a farmer, Dionisio Pulido, and his wife Pola were burning shrubbery in their cornfield when they observed the earth in front of them swell upward and crack to form a fissure 2 to 2.5 m across. They heard hissing sounds and later described the rise of smoke from the fissure, which had the repugnant smell of rotten eggs. The rotten egg smell is a hallmark of hydrogen sulfide gas, and the crack that opened in front of them would, within hours, develop into a small volcano. Within 24 hours, the eruption had generated a 50 meters high scoria cone. Within a week, it had grown to a height of 100 meters from the accumulation of bombs and a pili, and finer fragments of ash were raining down on the village of Paracutin. The eruption became more powerful, generating eruptive columns several kilometers high. Occasionally, the volcano would exhibit volcanian type activity, with large cannon like explosions separated by short periods of silence. On June 12, a lobe of lava began to advance toward Paracutin village and people began to evacuate the village. By August 1944, most of the villages of Paracutin and San Juan were covered in lava and ash. All that remained of San Juan were two church towers that stood above a sea of rugged lava. The Paracutin eruption was unusually long, with several eruptive phases occurring over a nine-year period. The eruption ceased in 1952 with the final height of the scoria cone at 424 meters. 6. Galapagos Islands, Ecuador The world-renowned Galapagos Archipelago is located in the Pacific Ocean, approximately 1,000 kilometers off the coast of Ecuador. The remote islands are one of the world's premier wildlife viewing destinations and feature on many an adventurous bucket list. Because the islands are home to such an exceptional diversity of wildlife, much of which is found nowhere else on Earth, tourism is very carefully controlled to protect the fragile environment. The waters around the islands are home to a vast collection of marine life, which makes scuba diving in the area one of the highlights of any visit. You can either explore the islands on a live aboard boat or choose to island hop from one inhabited island to another and do day trips to the more remote, uninhabited islands. Famous for inspiring Charles Darwin's theory of evolution, the Galapagos Islands are known for their unique and fearless wildlife. The iguanas, sea lions, penguins, finches, and tortoises that inhabit the picturesque islands are certainly not camera shy. They'll approach humans without hesitation. Among the natural wonders, the Galapagos Islands are perhaps most famous for their biological diversity. Together, all of the species that visitors are most eager to see are known as the Big 15, a play on Africa's Big Five safari animals. 5. Halong Bay, Vietnam Halong Bay is a popular tourist destination thanks to its gorgeous limestone casts and floating fishing village. The landscape formed by its 1,600 to 2,000 islands and islets, most of them uninhabited, is just spectacular. The bay features thousands of islands, each topped with thick jungle vegetation, forming a spectacular seascape of limestone pillars. Several of the islands are hollow, with enormous caves. Others' islands include lakes and some support floating villages of fishermen. Thanks to these unusual landforms, many of them still unaffected by human impact, the area became a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1994. The region is a popular spot among hikers, kayakers, and scuba divers. Beautiful Halong Bay, meaning Bay of Descending Dragons, is located in northern Vietnam, approximately 100 miles east of the city of Hanoi. Nothing quite prepares you for the dramatic scenery encountered in this UNESCO World Heritage Site, which is often included as one of the natural wonders of the world. 
The enormous bay is liberally dotted with unique limestone casts, which rise majestically from the sea, many of them covered in dense forestation and hiding extensive sea caves. The best way to see as much of this magical bay as possible is to take a bay cruise on a traditional junk boat. It is also possible to island hop between the inhabited islands and to visit some of the remarkable caves. 4. Komodo Island, Indonesia The Komodo Island in Indonesia is famous for being home to the beastly Komodo dragons, the world's biggest lizard, and it's an incredibly scenic place with lots of other bucket list travel experiences. The UNESCO-designated Komodo National Park has dozens of islands with white and pink sand beaches, exotic mountains for trekking and coral reefs for diving. And it's the only place in the world where you can see Komodo dragons up close in the wild and get your picture taken with them. Its history also makes it a special place as its inhabitants are said to be descendants of former convicts who were exiled to the island in the 19th century by a sultan in Sumbawa. Komodo Island is also home to gorgeous tropical forests, renowned diving sites, and gorgeous beaches, one of which boasts the pink sand and teal blue waters. You can knock out all the top sites of Komodo National Park, including the dragons in one full day tour, or it's possible to stay in a liverboard boat and spend several days sightseeing. You can see the dragons all year round. Prime diving season is March to October, High season for Komodo National Park is July to August, when the weather is cooler and more comfortable, but the park is also more crowded with tourists. The scenery and dragons are honestly spectacular in any month of the year, so regardless of when you go, you're sure to have a very memorable trip. 3. Uluru, Northern Territory, Australia Uluru, also known as Ayers Rock, is a stunning rock formation located in a particularly remote region of the Australian outback. The rock brilliantly reflects the beautiful hues of sunrise and sunset in the vast desert landscape. Uluru ranking among the continent's most recognizable natural wonder icons is a massive sandstone mountain rising up over the arid red center near Alice Springs in the Northern Territory. The Anangu people, one of the oldest human societies in the world, are the traditional and current custodians of Uluru. The monolith is protected by Uluru Kata Chuta National Park, which includes a further 36 red rock domes, which visitors can explore on foot along one of several hiking trails or on a guided tour. Uluru is sacred and spiritual site to native Australians and climbing on the rock is not permitted as climbing the rock is considered disrespectful to them. It can also be dangerous. There are several other ways to enjoy the unique location, including getting an aerial view from a helicopter or plane. Highlights of any visit include watching the sunrise or sunset over the rock, visiting the cultural center, and simply enjoying the beautiful location and spiritual atmosphere of Uluru. 2. Marble Caves, Patagonia, South America Picture yourself sailing the calm ripples of Chile's largest glacial lake en route to a remote marble structure, nestled within a humble group of rock islands. The bow of your boat moves straight through the mouth of the solid grotto, and immediately, you notice a ceiling of bold, swirling lines so bright they must have been painted on. Your attention drifts to the surrounding rock walls covered in various shades of blue, including sapphire, seafoam greens, and turquoise. It isn't until your neck gently reminds you that you've been staring up for too long that you begin to notice the natural beauty that resides beneath you. The marble caves in the heart of Patagonia boast streaky pastel-colored walls that surround ice-blue lake water. Only accessible by boat, the waves are considered one of the most isolated natural wonders of the world. 1. Giant's Causeway, Northern Ireland Formed by volcanic activity some 50 million years ago, Giant's Causeway is an assortment of tens of thousands of black cylindrical basalt rocks stretching out into the sea that separates Northern Ireland from Scotland. The unique display has long inspired stories of giants traversing the ocean. Located in County Antrim on the scenic north coast of Northern Ireland, the Giant's Causeway is an area of over 40,000 adjacent basalt columns that were created by a series of ancient volcanic eruptions. 
What makes these remarkably stepping stones so special is that each and every one of them is symmetrical and interlocking, as though they were carefully set in place by a giant hand. You can learn more about the 60 million year formation of the causeway at the visitor's center, where you can view an interactive audio-visual presentation before setting off to explore the site. Thousands of years of natural erosion have polished many of the stones to a smooth finish, and you are advised to wear sturdy walking shoes. Hope you enjoyed this scenic tour to some of the most amazing natural wonders. Let us know your thoughts in the comments section and watch these videos of more scenic tour through the choicest places around the world.